Yeremiahu Jeremiah 33. Moreover, the word of Yahuwah came unto El Yeremiahu the second time, while he was yet shut up in the court of the prison, saying, Thus says Yahuwah, the maker thereof, Yahuwah that formed it, to establish it, Yahuwah is his name. Call unto me, and I will answer you, and show you great and mighty things which you know not. For thus says Yahuwah, the Elohai of Yashadael, concerning the houses of this city, and concerning the houses of the kings of Yahudah, which are thrown down by the mounts, and by the sword. They come to fight with Eth the Kazdim, but it is to fill them Eth with the dead bodies of men, whom I have slain in my anger, and in my fury, and for all those, rather all whose wickednesses, rather all whose wickedness I have hid my face from this city. Behold, I will bring it health and cure, and I will cure them, and will reveal unto them the abundance of peace and truth. And I will cause at the captivity of Yahudah and at the captivity of Yashadael to return and will build them as at the first. And I will cleanse them from all their iniquity, whereby they have sinned against me. And I will pardon all their iniquities, whereby they have sinned, and whereby they have transgressed against me. And it shall be to me a name of joy, a praise and an honor before all the nations of the earth, which shall hear eth all the good that I do unto them, and they shall fear and tremble for all the goodness and for all the prosperity that I procure unto it. Thus says Yahuwah, Again there shall be heard in this place, which ye shall be, rather which ye say shall be desolate, without man and without beast, even in the cities of Yahudah and in the streets of Yerushalayim, that are desolate, without man, and without inhabitant, and without beast. The voice of joy, and the voice of gladness, the voice of the bridegroom, and the voice of the bride, the voice of them that shall say, Praise eth Yahuwah Sevaoth, for Yahuwah is good, for his mercy endures forever. And of them that shall bring the sacrifice of praise, into the house of Yahweh, for I will cause to return at the captivity of the land, as at the first, says Yahweh. Thus says Yahweh Sevoth, again in this place, which is desolate, without man and without beast, and in all the cities thereof, shall be a habitation of shepherds, causing their flocks to lie down in the cities of the mountains, in the cities of the valley, and in the cities of the Negev, and in the land of Binyamin, and in the places about Jerusalem, and in the cities of Yahudah, shall the flocks pass again under the hands of Yah, or rather, of him that tells them, says Yahuwah. Behold, the days come, says Yahuwah, that I will perform at that good thing which I have promised unto the house of Yashadael and to the house of Yahudah. In those days and at that time will I cause the branch of righteousness to grow up unto David, and he shall execute judgment and righteousness in the land. In those days shall Yahudah be saved and Yerushalayim shall dwell safely. And this is the name wherewith she shall be called, Yahuwah Siddiknu. For thus says Yahuwah, David shall never want a man to sit upon the throne of the house of Yashadael. Neither shall the priests the Levim want a man before me to offer burnt offerings and to kindle meat offerings and to do sacrifice continually. 
And the word of Yahweh came unto El Yeremiahu, saying, Thus says Yahweh, If ye can break eth my covenant of the day, and eth my covenant of the night, and that there should not be day and night in their season, then may also my covenant be broken with eth David my servant, that he should not have a son to reign upon his throne, and with eth the Leviim, the priests, my ministers. As the host of heaven cannot be numbered, neither the sand of the sea measured, so will I multiply eth the seed of David my servant, and eth the Leviim that minister unto me. Moreover, the word of Yahuwah came to El Yeremiahu, saying, Consider you not what this people have spoken, saying, The two families which Yahuwah have chosen, he has even cast them off. Thus they have despised at my people, that they should be no more a nation before them. Thus says Yahuwah, If my covenant be not with day and night, and if I have not appointed the ordinances of heaven and earth, then will I cast away the seed of Yaakov and David my servant, so that I will not take any of his seed to be rulers over the seed of Avraham, Yitzchak, and Yaakov. For I will cause eth their captivity to return and have mercy on them.